At this Christmas time, we remember that there are 42,700 U.S. troops still serving in Afghanistan on this holiday. And ABC's Mike Betcher spent more than two years embedded with some of them and brings us now a report as part of an ABC News special campaign, Home for the Holidays. Shauna Arachaga and her five-year-old son Austin are getting their home ready for the holidays. I actually was really excited to put up my Christmas tree this year. They've been living here for less than a year. Before that, Fort Campbell, Kentucky was home with this man, his father, her husband. But I think about him every day and I'll never stop thinking about him. Army Sergeant Ofren Arachaga was stationed in Afghanistan. My son Carlos and I were embedded with his battalion when he and his comrades came under attack in one of the deadliest firefights of the war. We remember that smile. Everybody does. Sergeant Arachaga, one of six killed. After, Shauna didn't want to live in their house anymore. Too many ghosts of AC, as everyone called him. Too many memories. I never wanted to leave that house, but I knew I had to. So we reached out to the charity Homes for Our Troops, and they went to work, providing this newly renovated home free of charge. It's huge. Being here is amazing. It's like starting over. But this holiday season, that home, not the only gift for Shauna and her son. Hi. Hi. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good. This is Sergeant Mendez, her husband's best buddy. I was a friend of your daddy's. He tried to save him that day, and this week, he traveled to Ohio to tell her something. I tried to get there as fast as I could, and I'm sorry that uh, you didn't make it. The gift of healing and of living in the present. I'm going to watch my son grow up, and I'm going to put up the Christmas tree for him every year, and, um, and I'm learning to embrace life. <laughs> Mike Betcher, ABC News, Indianapolis.